there could be good news on the way when it comes to those high drug prices. The Biden administration has started to negotiate with big pharmaceutical companies. The goal here is to bring down the cost of some of the most popular drugs used by people on Medicare. Our senior business correspondent, Christine Romans, is here with the details. Christine, you came in my office yesterday and you said, this is a big deal. Oh. Yes. So what drugs are we talking about? This is a landmark deal. It's the U.S. government for the first time really being able to use its clout as the biggest buyer of these drugs mm -hmm. through Medicare to negotiate prices. So we're talking about cancer drugs, diabetes drugs, oh. arthritis, blood thinners. You can see them here. Eloquist. Look at all these names. You've probably seen these ads. These yeah. are widely yeah. advertised yeah. drugs, widely used. It's a 10 drugs here. Uh, there's a blood cancer drug called Imbruvica, Genuvia, Jardiance. You can see mm -hmm. Stellara there. That's a psoriasis drug. You get this uh, injection every eight weeks and it's $25,000, I think. So wow. the government picking these drugs to sit down with uh, drug companies and say, all right, we're your biggest buyer. Let's negotiate mm -hmm. some discounts. Well, well, let's talk about the discounts. I mean, how much money are we potentially talking about folks being able to save on these on these drugs? So experts are saying maybe anywhere from 25 to 60 percent, depending oh. on the drug here. Right. So these are lucrative drugs for the drug uh, industry. But also these are drugs that the U.S. government is paying money for, like 50 billion dollars in Medicare costs for these drugs in particular. And we know that out of pocket, 3.4 billion is what seniors spell, spend for these drugs. So People are paying out of pocket. The government is also paying. So this is sort of the taxpayer trying to use its clout to negotiate lower prices. So this is going to, as you said, impact people on Medicare. What about people who are not on Medicare? Will they see those discounts? So often insurance companies match what ah. Medicare is getting with drug companies. So this could lead for these these prices to go down. Now, I will say the drug industry is fighting this. Mm -hmm. This is something that was made law by the Inflation Reduction Act. Also in that Inflation Reduction Act, something that people are seeing right now, and that is a cap out of pocket for part Medicare Part D recipients. Mm -hmm. So right now there are people in this country who are feeling a little better about things, and that cap will lower to $2,000 out of pocket for Part D recipients by the year 2025. So watch this space. Okay. The negotiations landmark, they're just beginning. Uh, 2026 is when this needs to be, according to the law, these, these lower prices need to be intact. In, in All right. We'll give you some relief, that's yeah. for sure. All right. Thanks, Thanks Christine. Thanks. Happy Friday. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.